following the killing of three geologists and two UPDF officers, security have intensified operations in the Kalamoja sub-region. This of this problem, of course, first of all, we have the historical fact that cattle rustling has been a problem since 1912. AK-47, popular assault rifles, a monopoly of military, now in the hands of local Kalimajong. Intensified our operations geared at pursuing the criminal elements that are illegally armed across the general areas of Karamoja sub region. We are also continuing to strengthen our surveillance on the border stretch with the neighboring countries, the east and the northeast. UPDF 3rd Division spokesperson Major Isaac Owale has confirmed that a number of guns and ammunition have been recovered during operation. This gives us a total of 184 illegal gun, guns recovered since the operation commenced July 2021 and 2,352 ammunition. We have also put out of our action 309 criminal elements and arrested 17, 1,792. And out of those, at least 306 have appeared in the court martial and civil court. Yes, you know, uh, our colleagues, the police, have asked to and stock uh, theft unit and then the UPDF third division that are operating uh, collectively or concurrently to join together to deal with this cattle theft. It's true, some individuals are, but it's mainly the young people that are involved. UPDF has deployed forces, especially in sport areas of Polas border, to deter Turkana wrestlers from crossing into their country. The joint forces of UPDF and police operation in Kalamoja have so far recovered 2,000 livestock, 2,352 rounds of ammunition, and 184 guns since the operation began this year. Haruna Mutesa Sira, UBC.